Hello everyone, I'm Sean. Alright, and this is Everyday Food Reviews. Uh, today, we've got another energy drink review. And this is on Boost, Cherry Burst and Punch Power. So, there's not many cherry flavoured energy drinks about. And uh, when I do get b uh, Boost, um, I tend to get the cherry one. Um, it's because, like I say, there's, there's not many other... Cherry, cherry drinks about. Um, the punch power is sugar free, um, which is interesting because you know, uh, punch power, other punch drinks you think of uh, Rockstar and Monster, uh, they both have uh, punch lines. Um, punch lines, uh, yeah, it's mango, passion fruit, and cranberry, but unlike other drinks, <clears throat> it doesn't, doesn't have any actual. Uh, juice in it because it's sugar free and juice has sugar. Uh, the cherry one um, also doesn't have juice in it. Um, it's got fruit and vegetable concentrates but no juice and it, it does have sugar but it's only got 4.9 grams per 100 ml. Um, so we'll, tr we'll try the punch power first. I think um, after this video we'll have covered all of the sort of flavoured boost drinks. Um, I've got boost cola left to do but I want to put it in a video with something else but I'm not sure what. So if you... not coke energy, um, something comparable like some cheap energy cola. If you've got any ideas let us know what we could do that with. Um, this smells mostly of passion fruit um, when I open it. It's, it's purple uh, like, like the can. Um, it does smell very fruity, it smells quite sour. Uh, both of these have, you know, your standard amounts of uh, caffeine, uh, well, slightly lower than the standard amounts actually, the 30 milligrams per 100 ml. Um, I do like the can design of the, the power, uh, punch power one, because it's got the black around the bottom, I think, whenever there's black on the can. It just looks a bit cooler. Um, black and purple. I'd like it better if it didn't have this big price mark around the top of it, but I mean, with, with Boost, that's usually the main selling point of it, is it's 49p and other energy drinks are... Well, Rock, Rock, I've said it before, Rockstar's 99p and the can's twice the size, so it's twice the price and twice the size. It's essentially the same value, but if, if you don't want a full 500ml can, um, or even if you do, you could get two of these for the same price and uh, they, they might uh, stay colder or fizzier um, or what have you, instead of warming up in your hand while you're drinking it. Yeah, Sm smells mostly of passion fruit. It says mango, passion fruit and cranberry. Cheers. Yeah, it kind of tastes just like a sort of berry mix or something. It's it's there's sourness from the passion fruit and a sort of tartness from the cranberry. I'm not getting much of a taste of mango. Um, that's quite subtle in comparison, I think. Um, this is it's not a bad drink though. It's quite pleasant and unlike. Other similar flavours, this one's sugar free. I think I do like. I think this is possibly nicer than the similar sort of sugar free rock stars that we've had, you know, the uh, the Revolt line that they did a while ago. Um, there's the XD Power line now with more, more caffeine, but their price marks at £1.29, so they are uh, more expensive. So, uh, cherry, cherry burst. The can's just generally quite pink. Try this. I, I have had this before. I'm not sure if I've had the punch power before. I thought I had, but I don't remember it tasting like that, so maybe I haven't. So, this one's pink in colour. Yeah, it smells 
It smells of cherry. Quite a sharp sort of sour cherry. Cheers. Yeah, it's it's funny because this doesn't have any actual juice in, but it tastes like a really sort of juicy, almost natural cherry. Um, it's not like a sort of, you know, the sneak or G Fuel cherry flavours you get. I don't know why we don't see many cherry energy drinks. It's not like cherry tango. It's not overly sweet. It's more, more of a sour cherry flavour. <laughs> Excuse me. There's a bit of tartness to it. It's it's nice. Like I say, if I do get boost, this tends to be the one I get, even though it's got sugar in. There is another cherry energy drink. It's one of the cheaper off-brand ones. I think it's it's either LSV or Best One or something. And that's thirty-five or thirty-nine p. So it's a bit cheaper, but it's it's much less palatable, and you don't see it as often. I think they, they do a sour apple one as well that's, again, it, it's okay, but it, it's cheaper and you don't see it so much. Um, but I'd still sooner pick one of them up for 39p than I would pick up, you know, Emerge or any of those other sort of 20, 39p um, sort of Red Bull flavoured ones. Um, I'd, I'd still rather have have something that's just, you know, a generic flavour, even if it's not bang on, a generic flavour, a uh, cherry or apple or something, rather than something that's trying to taste like Red Bull and just not quite doing it and just tasting of syrup. Um, yeah, I do, I do enjoy this cherry one on occasion. Now, as I was talking and describing the taste of these, I thought, why not try mixing them together? Because you've got passion fruit, mango and cranberry, and I can't taste much of the mango, and you've got cherry and monster punch and pipeline punch. Um, the sort of defining characteristic of them, I find, is that, that sort of little hint of cherry you get in that fruit mix. Um, obviously they all have actual juice in, but I'm wondering if this would pop just a little bit more with some of the cherry in. I didn't think, I only thought this since I started recording the video. This isn't something I planned on doing. Yeah, it's, it's, it's colours similar to the Monster Mixed Punch. No, it smells mostly of the punch power. Cheers. You know, it's not bad, but there's there's a lot going on there. It does have a little bit of a sort of mixed, mixed monster mix punch vibe to it now. And there's obviously a lot less sugar. Um, obviously, you're going to need a glass or something if you want to mix them together, but you, you can get both of these for a pound, or 98p. Um, Yeah. Yeah, it's alright. Yeah, boost if you're watching. I doubt you are. Do do a drink, sugar or sugar free. I don't think it matters a lot to be honest. Um let's put some cherry flavour in this. Or put some either t take the sugar free one, put some cherry flavour in it, or take the cherry one and put some uh passion fruit, cranberry, mango, whatever in that. I think this is possibly a stronger drink. Have it with a name similar to the monster. You're not going to mistake it for the monster, but it's just got that sort of vibe to it. Yeah, it's, it's considerably more sour, but then mixing these together, you got two and a half grams of sugar per 100 ml, whereas the monster punches have about uh, somewhere between 10 and 12 grams, so it's got a fifth of the sugar. Yeah, 
Yeah, I quite like that. Yeah, um, didn't didn't end how I anticipated. Thought I'd just do a quick video on those two, but um, yeah, thanks thanks very much for watching. Uh, stay safe, and uh, we'll see you next time. Cheers.